Hello Game Boys and Game Girls, I'm the Game Boy Guru and welcome to episode 2 of Re-Unboxing. I promise this episode will be much shorter than the debut. Uh, I'm going to be doing this one box at a time, so uh, there may be some days when I record multiple videos in a day and get them all uploaded, but um, let's just get started with box number 2. <clears throat> so this is Boxed Genesis Games. <clears throat> so here we have... Earthworm Jim, NFL Quarterback Club 96, Eternal Champions, Cool Spot, Disney's Aladdin, Cliffhanger, Earth Defense, otherwise known as The Earth Defend. It's an unlicensed shoot 'em up. <laughs> Coach K, College Basketball. Desert Strike. Columns. Chester Cheetah, Too Cool to Fool. Boogerman, A Pick and Flick Adventure. <clears throat> Chuck Khan, The Forever Man. Always think of Shaka Khan when I hear that. Biohazard Battle, Great Shoe Up. NHL 94 Outrun Fantasy Star 3 Arch Rivals Echo The Tides of Time <clears throat> Decap Attack One of my childhood favorites <clears throat> NHL 96 and Bulls versus Lakers in the NBA playoffs that is all in this box but as a bonus I thought I would show off a couple of loose carts here in this box I have Techno Clash <clears throat> Bill Walsh College Football which I remember having quite a bit of fun with uh, as a kid. The Sega Genesis Game Genie. And the real treat here is my Sega Nomad. Now my Nomad has been modified uh, with a new screen. The screen cover is still the same. It's got a couple of scratches in it. But the actual LCD inside is better than the real blurry um, original screen that came in these Nomads. Uh, so not only is it a better looking screen, but it also is easier on the battery. <clears throat> in addition to that, the gentleman who did that mod also modded the official battery pack. So instead of this coming open and me being able to put in six double A's, you can see he dremeled that out and um, <clears throat> there's a deal in there for what is essentially a large camera battery and so <clears throat> I can use this charger that would have charged the battery itself to charge up this battery pack and instead of the requisite uh, two or two and a half hours that you might get out of the six double A's uh, I can actually get somewhere between four and six hours of playtime with this new battery pack so fantastic <clears throat> um, this is the AV cord that you can use to hook up the Nomad to the TV uh, because here on the top you can see there there's the AV port and then there's the connector for it <clears throat> and um, 
There's even a car charger for the battery pack, um, which I'm assuming was to have been a car charger for the camera or the battery charger um, for whatever camera he stole that out of. So that's bonus content uh, in this in this second episode. Um, my Nomad is awesome now that it's been modded. Uh, it's fun to use. I haven't got to use it in a while, uh, obviously because I've been packing. But um, I'm thinking I might uh, I might have to take it to work with me and uh, play it on lunch break or something. Uh, you know, switch off, switch one day, maybe PSP, Nomad, Game Boy, etc and just kind of have some fun with that. So anyway, that was episode two of re-unboxing um, with Box Genesis games, all complete with manuals. Let me know what you guys think in the comments section below. Um, <clears throat> what do you think of these games? Are any of these uh, favorites of yours? Let me know. Thanks for watching, thanks for playing, and game on.